This daf Yomi Yerushalmi in the article Oz Bahadur edition. We are on Daf Chav Beis Amud Aleph, and we got up to um, uh, the two dots in uh, the the, the um, fifth line down. Tvua b'tvua Beis Rova. In the Vilna um, edition, it's Daf Yud Beis Amud Aleph. Uh, the second line down, to a to a base rova. Okay, so the um, the uh, halacha is that if you want to distance yourself, for, uh, 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 distance one two types of grain in uh, close proximity, you need to have a base rova between them. You know, we've learned already several times in the um, in the uh, in the mesechta. Um, Uh, and uh, as long as it's not uh, um, uh, surrounded on the four uh, four sides, in other words, if there are uh, if there you have a fence, I think the article might have a picture actually. Well, it's not a great picture, but in the Rosh Cerulio, there is a picture. We have the art scroll. There you have the tour and the tour and the base of the middle, but it's surrounded by a fence. So that fence makes it chavush. Okay, so that's a, that is the problem. That it doesn't work. Um, actually, the chavush by Abba and Chosea, there's no fence around the entire thing. Rabbi Zira Barakum Rabbi Asa. Rabbi Zira asked for Rabbi Asa. Is it this true? Because Simunya, we only we only allowed to uh, uh, plant one type of grain because Simunya was very very large, evidently, but it was uh, surrounded with uh, a uh, a fence. So uh, how far out does the fence have to be in order to be able to plant two minim and not consider them chavush? Um, this, uh, so the fasting of Chaim here says, Anisha Bakushya, the Gemara does not uh, resolve this question, and he says, Yesh Omri de Mikam Akolam Hashish Mita Ram Akodine Chavush. Some say the Rambam left out all of the halachas of Chav, all the parameters of Chavush, which Pin Yushami, because he believes that the Gemara is uh, not answering this question, means that Chavush, since it's imp- uh, it has no defined parameters, and therefore it was not accepted as being halacha. It's an amazing thing, right? Masev Rabbi Eliezer Rabban. Rabbi Eliezer asked Rabban, "Come on, that is the chon kal b'shura the chomer b'meruba." So the Rabbi Eliezer said, "You have uh, if you want." In our Mishnah, he said that vegetables to be distant from grain is six foot vachim is enough. So you hold that a you Rabban hold that a shura of vegetables by Grain, you don't have to go the distance of a rova. Um, the um, only by you have a chomer bin maruba when you have a uh, patch, a square of vegetables uh, 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 in proximity to a square of grain. But it's related by uh, in that case, you need a rova, right? So the um, uh, 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 the 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 Reb Chaim goes with the gears of the Rashi really here. Cain easily come in Maruba. I also hold there's a kula by Maruba. In other words, even uh, as long as uh, it's vegetables next to uh, grain, even if it's they're both uh, square square tracts, you still only need six tefachim. Um, uh, so v'hein uh, ashkechon instead of Cain ashkechon, it's v'hein ashkechon. These are abundant cow bashura the chomer beruma. How we where do we find that Rabbanan said this thing that it's uh, it's there's a, uh, it's more lenient with a um with a, a strip and more severe with a square. Uh, we learned that um kadodetani a rotsa so we had this before a rotsa la so shura shal yarekatok state rotsa only wants to make a row of vegetables within his. Uh, the grain field. So he makes the length of a shura, which is ten half hamos long, by al rocham shisha, and on the width of six tefachim. So the um, 
and you can plant in that uh, in, in that area. Um, Rabbi Yochanan says, uh, This this is um. Now, it's important to note just before we go further. Um, Rabbanu, by a strip, you don't need anything because the strip is clearly distinct by itself. You don't need six six tzvachim. As it says, okay, you all day you don't need anything. Fine, I'm asking with you. I just told uh, more machmir by a rova, a square is just like you, but I'm not machmir to you know, jump to a base rova. It's enough for me to have six tzvachim. So the um. But one of those answers, I'm uh, answer to This shura uh, has to have one, this strip has to have only one type of vegetables. Not even two vegetables that are not combined with each other. Um, uh, sound, uh, uh, or, or alternatively, could be that there can be uh, uh, two vegetables which are not combined with each other as long as you distance themselves a certain way. It says Ukhaim and uh, it doesn't look like um, everything is mixed together. Um, uh, Rabbi Ziva said, "Mother Rabbi Yochanan shows you Shiba. Uh, Rabbi Yochanan can see when there's se- there's seven tefachim wide. Shows there tefach mikan. He can plant a tefach on one side, uh, uh, on, to the entire length of the strip. A tefach mikan and a tefach on the other side of the stri- strip. Um, and as long as the distance between the two of them is appropriate." Um, uh, which is five, right? One step back on one side, one step back on the other side, five in the middle. Also, uh, the, uh, those five which you live in, leave in the middle, they are, um, um, can be taken with each side, which Rukhaim explains to me that each side, uh, it's, it's, uh, you have one on this side, plus five, and one on this side plus five, so it comes out six tvachim for each one. So the, the the blank area in the middle is doing double duty as um, the six tvachim, which uh, uh, to start up with both sides. And we have a picture of that. Um, we have here. There's a strip of kishu on one side. A strip of the ruin on the other side. Each one tap on. The five bucket blank in the middle. Right? And it's ten and a half hours long. That's okay. Uh the um I add myself added here that there's could be two on this side, the Eric on that side. Well uh there's two or sorry, grain on both sides, because of course that's all luck of a strip. It doesn't require grain up on any archaka, as long as you have the the six the kashivas of six bucket. Um Says more further. Um de Ma Rabbi Zira, uh with that which Rabbi Zira said, uh Khan takes out the word Masiv, Al Rabbi Yochanan Tamon, uh the the what he said uh else in previously, uh and that is um a seal also we saw, which is um The, 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 a similar idea. The Chatsi Kav in the middle joins up with the Chatsi Kav on each side and make it a full Kav Harachaka. Right, you have uh, many other base towards at the end. Chatsi Kav over here, Chatsi Kav over here, Chatsi Kav in the middle, and then the base towards over there. And if he has Sa'orin on this one, Shibolashu on this one, Chitim on this one, Keep them on that one. So we saw we saw that but here back then, and um, uh, over here, so based on that seer, notach notach. Well, actually, um, uh, that is not the end of that because that's the comparison. It's the chazi kav in the middle joined up with the chazi kav on each side. Here to the five tefachim in the middle, join up with the tefach on each side. Okay, not a chatzishur. If you planted half a, a, of a row, 
Now you slightly want to start another shura. So again, we have a, a picture of this. Um, you have uh, six vachim. And you planted half the shura. Six point across, 10.5 uh, uh, length. You planted half. Okay. Now you want to do something else, right? Um, in the rest of the um, in the rest of that area, another chadish of Amad Lo Bikesh Laskil B'Shura Acheres Chista Mar Aser. Chista says Aser. Oh, Amad Lo Acheres Ashura or Malei Ashura. Either put it ready, plant it, or fill it up. You can't fill. You can't put something else in, in the middle once you start it. Um uh Rabbi Yudan Omar Ispan Rebhi Bar Bar Rabbi Shmu Bar Rav Yitzchak. They they have machlekas. These two Kharamar feel shlosha lutoch shisha. Even three out of six is good enough. Which I think we had something coming out. Even though plant plant three out of six is good enough. We have a half of the grid back when. But it's not he says even you plant three uh, you just leave it blank here. Uh, three of the six, that's good enough. Um, uh, uh, you can even do three of the six and plant three of the six. Three strips within your strip. One, two, three strips. Okay, that's good enough. Different, different things. Um, Uh, lots of pictures in the article, but I don't th don't think that they are necessarily helpful. Except that um, he does have a picture in which he tells us which what each one uh, shear the shears yeah of these three strips. You have a tefach on one side, a tefach on the other side, and a tefach in the middle, and the gap between each of these tefachim is one and a half tefachim. Okay, so uh, this is not drawn to. Um, is not drawn to scale. Um, um, not even sure that, that he means for this picture to be used for this purpose. He's used later on. But the point is that, so may, maybe, um, this should show the article picture down here. One, 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 one and a half, one and a half in the middle. Um, uh, we don't know which of the which of these uh, Moraim took which position in this uh, in this uh, in this dispute. One said um, uh, the, the, the one who said uh, uh, three within six. Uh, uh, and th it like. Um, Yeah, three means within six means three out of six, or three within six, like this, which means three strip, strips. This way, or this way. Who said what? So, um, in Mada Marabi Yosef and Chiv, Shemu Yochan, Vachelo, Yehei Shom Churva, um, uh, 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 Shalom, you know what? I realize now. Looking at the picture, I know I didn't notice it. Well, this is actually the article's picture, which is the same. It is a uh, kind of the same as the article picture. Three. It's the same, the same principle. Just uh, improving off that he didn't make it a strips, he made it round circles. But it's the same principle. Okay. So, um, so then, Madam Marius, Rabbi Chia, Shabbi Yochum, Bachelor, Yeshom, Harba, there shouldn't be a, a, a gap. Heavy Rabbi Shmuel, Rabbi Yitzchak, who the Amar Afilu, Echad Mikan, Bechad Mikan, the Echad Beemtza. Meaning, there shouldn't be any significant gaps uh, in that the, the six twelve him 
by 10.5 strip. So therefore, he must hold, and as it's obvious, the is not a grid in the other half, um, like we had before. It's about just plain land, and therefore, um, he uh, uh, therefore he's my uh, who holds that you can't have significant gaps in the plant in order to have that strip in the middle of your wheat field. Must hold that like this opinion, which holds you uh, uh, not you can, but you sh must. If you want to have two, three strips like that, and not three on one side and three blank on the other side. Of course, from our clue, you don't have to do it that way. Uh, it says, "Imayut sudden rabim ala chareva mutter." The um, uh, if you had the um, 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 more uh, planted, uh, even though there's a plant, uh, there's one in the middle, one on the other side, as long as it's, there's rove, like it's rove, 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 um, and therefore that's fine, even though you have two, even you have a gap in between. So, uh, the uh, as long as the majority is planted, not mechza, mechza, like uh, this uh, uh, in, the, in the picture we saw, and also not just on one side. So then you find a coin to everybody, and that's sufficient uh, to make it a strip unto itself, which can be planted in the middle of a grain field. And that brings us well into Dapchov Gimel, so we'll stop here, of course.